Slovak. Hello there, a warm good evening going out to you wherever you may find yourself. Hey, 55 days left and we are done with 2019. Yay. Yeah, I want to ask you, how have the previous months treated you so far? Has it been good, bad or ugly? Now guess what? This is the good, the bad and the ugly show. We are coming to you live from our studios inside is Lagon. My name is Nana Kuni Rajaman and I am doing this with Miss Helen Asante. I'm all good and feeling all ladylike, you know. Oh, my. Yeah. I'm in the bad seat today. Miss Ifia Jamal say. Good. In the ugly seat today again. I told what you. Can she's, I say? She's, she's claiming it. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm going to be good. I okay. <laughs> so here's what. This is where we sit and delve into the top stories in the newspapers. We will be right back. So this is the good, the bad, and the ugly show. Now let's take a quick look into our very first story. Um, that is a daily graphic. Coop plot allegations. Two senior officers arraigned today. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let me read a, a bit of the story so we delve into it. Assistant Commissioner of Police, ACP Dr. Benjamin Agojo, and Superintendent Peter Lanchini Tubu, who have been detained over their alleged involvement in a plot to destabilize the country will be arraigned today. Dr. Agojo is a seven police officer and former director of the Transformation Office of the Ghana Police Service, while Superintendent Tobu is the former executive secretary to the immediate past Inspector General of Police. Hmm. Ladies, before we delve into this, um, there is a video. Um, SCP uh, Gojo was in court today. We would want to take a look at it before. He's already in court? Yeah. Wow. These charges are frivolous. Mm -hmm. I'm as strong as anything. I'm not going to be bogged down. Nobody can gag me. Nobody can gag me. Nobody can gag me. I have not committed any crime. I've done nothing wrong. I mean, we are, the president called upon us to be citizens. So when I express my opinion on a WhatsApp platform, unrelated to any alleged coup, nobody should bog me down. And I'll stand for this. I'll stand for this till the end. Okay. Okay. They cannot break me down at all. It's okay. And I'm it's as okay. strong as anything. It's okay. It's Thank okay. you very much for your support. Thank you. And there you have it, Kind Ketsi City TV. Now, information reaching us is... Um, um, retired um, Mr. Tobu has been also arrested. Okay. So let me move to you, <laughs> Helen. You see, we're, uh, the whole paper, before I even go into this, mm. let me applaud our president. Right. For Should I good, use some of the names? Yes, please do. <laughs> for a good <laughs> work done guy. that he, he has paid the contractors mm. to start work on the Eastern Corridor okay. Road. Right. The supposed Eastern Corridor Road that was in some people's Green Book or mm. Blue Book or Violet Book. Right. Claiming it was done. Right. Now is actually, paid, he's paid contractors mm. to commence work by, uh, before the end of the year. Right. So it's a good thing for, for us. It's a good thing. Well done, Mr. President. And I actually um, want to congratulate the BNI on this because, you know, this is a very, very serious it's serious business. We can't have gone on the days where um, cases like this come in and then it slip like that. But mm -hmm. this, this is not a police that is going to take bribes and just let suspects disappear. Mm -hmm. Just like Thank that. Thank you. Thank you for giving me my point. Anyway. <laughs> 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 for a minute, I was thinking, of what am I going to say? <laughs> so say it all for me, and let me just comment on it. Yes, they are, they, are, they are not going to take part, right. because this is a very serious mm -hmm. business. Mm -hmm. And um, 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 the, the BNI, the, the security agencies mm -hmm. or the investigators, they are not 
leaving any stone right. unturned. Exactly. And they're trying to get to the bottom of this case to mm. pro to, to prosecute it yeah. professionally. Right. Now let's look at this issue. I just watched the video and it sounds very confident. Mm -hmm. I'll be very happy for him if he's he's all um cases brought against him is dismissed. Mm. Then his confidence has spoken for him. Okay. It means that yes, truthfully, he has no hands in this. Okay. But before B and I will invite you into their office, it they means they, they have they know what you're right. doing. Exactly. So uh, for me, if you have uh, an ACP and a superintendent, mm -hmm. whether retired or not, these mm -hmm. are people that held positions. Mm -hmm. Let's not forget that it is a, they 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 are not being. Uh, 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 um, charged with any offense as at the time i don't know right now what's mm. going on but they are being treated as suspects right for aiding the main person behind the alleged, the court. alleged court. yes so they are being treated as suspects but for for bni to first of all invite you mm. it means they, they have know they know what exactly mm. and you are the they've put i, I only pray mm that there is no they come out clean okay. because then it will be very difficult to trust our security right because Especially you are superintendent the and then you know the people allegedly involved mm. military officers right police higher authority yes. of, uh, mm -hmm. officers yeah. It's they scary know for us. About of everything exactly, in the country. and these people—they are people with. They've built some brand for themselves. They, right. They've had experience mm. over the years, so you cannot just wake up today and say you want to tarnish their image. Mm. First of all, right. You understand? B and I know because they can sue you. Mm. At the end of the day, there's nothing you have. You have. Uh, uh, um, you have put their image on the line and right. their career or their profession on the exactly. line. So I know and I understand that B and I knows. They know this. They mm. know their human right. They understand their image. So if they are inviting them, it's for it's a for purpose. purpose. So we need to calm down and allow B&I to, to do their job. Right. To do their job. Let, and let there's me, a story. Okay. No, I want, let me move to Fia. Okay. I'll come back to you. Yes, I see her giving me all the, the, the <laughs> sexy looks. And I'm like, yo. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yes. What I know is you can't um, arrest somebody. You can't actually detain somebody unless he or she is proven guilty of what he or she is being arrested for. No, really. Because this is, this is even strictly BNI business. Mm. So he's in there for interrogation. Okay. It's not as if they are detaining him for... He's not been... He's been detained. Yes, he's been detained. Mm. But he needs to be questioned. Okay. You get it. Right. He needs to be questioned. Right. And that's even on the side. I think this is political why which hunting why trust me it's all because uh, this case happened weeks ago mm -hmm. but he was never ever arrested mm. or taken but the moment he was picked up and he was picked up until he delivered a message around yeah. at um, UN yeah that was when he was, after he delivered that message, which wasn't complimentary to the new administration. Right. Exactly. That's why they picked him up. Mm. But I, why? I, I personally also think because maybe he resigned and wanted to stand for... No, not him. Okay. I'm even talking about Mr. Agbojo. Yeah. I hope I... Yeah, the same man. Get, he resigned. Uh, and, he resigned. Yes. Okay, now okay, he's okay, contesting okay. for right. parliamentaries in... Why, yes, if, if I stand to be no, correct. But I think it's political. Mm. Because um, because of his famous presentation at the Institute for Democrat, Democratic Governance, right. IDEG, okay. that, where he bemoaned the political interference of the police service. Mm. And this is very true. Mm. We get all these politicians interfering and... Uh, the police duty all the time. Mm. So what's the big deal? Mm. Moreover, he's being interrogated because of a WhatsApp message. Are they serious? All these hours because he, because of a WhatsApp message he sent. he sent. And he was even advising them. Okay. If somebody can be detained for just a mere WhatsApp message, well, then, then we need really, to be careful. all of us <laughs> need to be right. careful. And I thought it was encrypted. Mm. I thought WhatsApp messages are encrypted. Mm -hmm. and So how? 
did they get access to? You get it. So uh, it's 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 very sad that they could just pick somebody up. And why were they even avoiding the family members and even mm. the lawyer mm. to it's get ours. to him? Why? He's not been proven guilty. He's just there for interrogations. So why are you picking? And you know, the other Mr. Tobu. Yeah. Mr. I saw Tobu. Mr. Tobu. I think the MPP are just bitter. Why do you say so? Because he was the assistant to the former IGP, um, Mr. Santia Pietu. Mm. And he resigned to join the NDC. Right. So uh, they are just better because it's more like your allegiance was towards us and you just move and you are going to our position. Mm. So whatever information you the have... The same kind of... Exactly. You are snake. going to... Right. You are going to right. snitch on us. Mm. You get it. So this whole thing is just political. I just mm. feel they are just not being fair to them because... You see, it's okay for you to say that it's political so witch hunting. You one yes, political witch hunting. Right. It's okay for her to be saying that okay. because yes, he resigned and he went to stand in for the Upper West yes. constituency under the NDC yeah, ticket. So obviously, you think it's it's political. But then again, I repeat, mm. BNI is no joke. Okay. If they take your case to BNI or BNI is after then you, serious. then it's serious. It's like FBI being after you. Mm. Of course. It's serious. If and BNI you, understands please. the implications, mm. the serious uh, lawsuits that will come after if for defamation or any form of uh, 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 um, humiliation upon themselves, they can sue you for that. Because right. then you have to make sure that before you, you come attacking me, mm. you have your facts. Mm. So, whether it's political witch hunting, and they're talking about the, 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 the tooth, some WhatsApp message, Messages and, and then saying, saying it's, 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 it's an Arab Spring scenario, mm -hmm. and that he contributed 2,000 to yeah. whatever. It has nothing. I'm, I'm not... I'm sure it has nothing to do with that. Okay. I mean, the issue to do here is it. our okay. national yeah. security. Right. Once again, we need to look at our national the security recruitment in this country. Mm. Because even people in the security service are the ones, are the ones being ones. allegedly accused. Right. Allegedly right. accused. Allegedly. So you it's see? scary for us. Okay. You Where see, are we going to? Where are we getting to? You see, if you're a police officer, mm. you don't have to get involved in all these things okay so i don't agree with the fact because even if even before they are tr they are picked also they put them th through training right so you can just pick him up and make an issue out of it just because he sent a whatsapp message no how how is that and why would you even uh, avoid the family members and even his lawyer mm. to get to him i'm more, sure more they were more, more, more you like see BNI he's has not, he's not been, he's not, it's BNI not, has arrested. Was it, was it just like, why didn't he arrest, why wasn't it's he it's arrested a long time ago? She's, it's your one minute she's saying. It's, it's obvious, so listen to me. Even it's it's obvious that, okay. that, it's obvious that this administration is not happy with his, um, his, his, Political, it, his political or? stance is even different. Okay. With his submissions lately okay. on all on, platforms, okay. and right. it's it's become very popular. So okay. they are just picking him, picking up on him, mm. because they are just not happy. That's a strictly political. Mm. That is what I believe in. Mm. And to even bring in Mr. Tobu, and er, we all saw how they reacted to Mr. Tobu's exit to the NDC. Mm. So, so this it's is quite, it's very just obvious. The, very, very obvious. He's done nothing. You think they'll and do nothing well, about it? He's done nothing. Popular. He's Ladies, very confident about it. But to make him popular. Thank you. He even had to okay, say that you. he's been treated very well he's by the BNI. Right. He thank said you. it. Thank you. Well, what I would say is this very uh, um, issue should be solved. Like you should have, it should be easy for everything to be done fast. So we, we, we have, we, 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 we really have to be doing important things. I'm not saying this is not important, but we really need to get Ghana moving forward. Let's take a break. We'll be right back. Are you expecting money from your relations abroad? Have you ever been defrauded of your money remittance? Open an ADB account today. Send your name and your account number to Relations Abroad. 
Ask them to use MoneyGram direct to account service and receive your money in your account in minutes. With MoneyGram direct to account service, there's no pin code wahala. You can now access your money on all ATMs in Ghana or send it to any mobile money wallet using ADB mobile banking app or short code star 767 hash. Visit our branches nationwide to conveniently receive your Western Union, MoneyGram, RIA, Unitylink, Transfast, and Express Money Transfers. Reach us on our Facebook, website, or call our hotline on 0302-210-210 for more information. ADB, truly agri and more. At 12 and 5 p.m., BNT Newsroom brings you the most topical, fact-based, and up-to-date news from Ghana and around the world. Politics, business, sports, and news from the diaspora all covered in this comprehensive news update. If it matters, DNT Newsroom will have it covered. DNT News, be informed. Welcome back. It's still the good, the bad, and the ugly. Let's take a look at our second story. We're taking that from, from the Ghanaian Times. It says, suspend payment of license fees. Three teacher uh, unions, let me take that again. Three teacher unions appeal to National Teacher Council. And the story is in page 17. I read, teachers unions have called for the immediate suspension of the policy requiring all in-service teachers to pay 200,000 Ghana cities um, to secure their teacher professional license. The policy also required of teachers to pay a renewal fee of 100 Ghana cities every two years. The call was contained in a statement signed and issued in Accra by President of Ghana um, National Association of Teachers, Ms. Philippa Lassen, President of National Association of Graduate Teachers, Mr. Eric Angel Kabonu, and the President of Coalition of Concerned Teachers, Ghana. Ha. Huh. <laughs> Helen. Yes. You see, uh, hmm. it's very sad how teachers have been neglected for a very long time mm. in this country. Mm. Yes, maybe teachers are more... Let, if we want to see teachers' profession as um, charity or giving back to society, then let's look at it that way. Okay. But if it's a profession or a more serious profession for them, then their welfare needs to be considered. Okay. I'm sure it's just not it's just not in Africa. It's around the world. Mm. Because what a teacher teaches the lawyer to become a lawyer. Right. A teacher teaches the president to become a president. president right. and the teacher is still walking around with his shoes uh, halfway gone or chewed by the rat. Mm. And it's, it's, it's sad to okay. understand. The same way we pay attention to police, the military, and whatnot, I think we should pay extra attention the nurses, the doctors. The we should pay extra attention because the teachers are teaching the nurses mm. and the doctors. So let's pay extra attention to the teachers. Mm. Let's give them some accommodation uh, 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 deals. Let's give them some, some vacation deals mm. to encourage them. Teaching is not an easy thing. Don't you think <laughs> they yeah, are not right. taking... The, the profession seriously that well you why. can you you may say that okay. you may say that but it is not an easy profession to okay. be in some even let's no consider psychology mood swing psychology mm. there are times as even as a human being you don't even feel like talking mm. and then you get to someone and the you you get to the class and by force you need to talk right you need to teach mm. how do you how do you even juggle with that mm. So for me, we need to really uh, uh, um, applaud our teachers because teachers go through a lot already. So why the stress right now? And why would the NTC hold a meeting with teachers union in some Oyarifa districts yeah. and ignore agreements reached with them? No. Why? Now, what was the purpose of the meeting? What was the purpose of if the meeting? they would go contrary to what they are doing. Exactly. And um, um, the absence of dialogue... What happened? I mean, if apparently all fees must be negotiated with the union before communicated 
before communicated. Right. All fees must be negotiated with the union before it's, it's, communicated. it's communicated. Was there a dialogue? Mm. Was it communicated to mm. them? Was it was there an agreement mm. that is the amount we want you to pay two hundred, and you say you can't afford it, so mm. let's dialogue and reduce it to a hundred. Okay. Was there a dialogue? Mm. You see, so it's like we are disregarding these teachers. We are not respecting their profession. We are not. We are not, we are not even concerned about their welfare. And it's very sad. If they don't teach, who is going to teach our kids in right. the school? Exactly. Who is going to be doing the teaching? Exactly. If, if they all say they're going on a strike, yes. what do we do? What do we do? What happens to the free SHS? Who's exactly. going to stay in the classroom and teach them? Mm. So it's about time we consider the, the, the welfare of these of teachers. Of these teachers. If you are Let's consider the welfare of these teachers. <laughs> yes, their welfare is very important. So is the doctor. Okay. So is the nurse. Mm. So is the musician. Mm. So are journalists. You get it. Mm. No pro let me let me just even clear that no profession is easy. Right. Nothing. In fact, not even profession. Everything in this world is not easy. Is not easy. So they should stop uh, crying foul. This is just just stop making noise. Okay. It's just the typical attitude of Ghanaians. Everything is a no. Everything should Every be Every good free. thing is no, because they are not willing to pay for anything. Exactly. Everything should be free. Mm. I keep saying this. Nothing is free. Pay for things so that you'll be able to question. Right. So they want to tell us that if it was increments in salary, wouldn't they have collected mm. the yes? Wouldn't they have spoken against that? Why are they not being given some and all that? Demonstrations, don't they go? If you are a teacher, you chose to be a teacher. Mm. If somebody chooses to be a nurse, they choose to, to be a nurse. Nurses are writing these exams. Right. They are not even paying the same. They are paying the same, the same, the amount. same amount. Right. So why are they making noise? Mm. This is the same amount the nurses are paying. Just pay so that you get your license. Mm -hmm. It's and high time work. we do things the right way. Somebody just gets up and they just go and teach. Mm. And they call themselves teachers. teachers. Especially when it comes to crutch. Mm. <laughs> glorified maids mm -hmm. are crutch teachers. Mm. They are maid servants who are glorified, polished a little. They call themselves teachers. teachers. So if you are able to sit down, write, write these licensure exam. e exams and you pass, then, then you, you call, call yourself, yourself a teacher. A teacher. Right. Pay for it. Just pay for it. So you also respect the profession as well. E e exactly. So where is this whole argument? If the, if the NTC is allowed mm. to do this, mm. trust me, then the nurses too should, should, should stand up mm. to this. Because if the teachers are allowed to bully their ways through this whole set, the, 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 yes, this whole payment of everything. registration and renewal fee and all that, right. then the nurses too will stand up and, and, and go against yes. it at a point. Right. So what is this whole big deal about? We won't we pay, won't and pay we, any. it's just a typical attitude of the Ghanaian. They won't pay tax. But, but they won't pay for anything. Pay for your registration, no. But if you have you uh, considered the amount, you know, it's not all teachers who. Receive the same amount of. Salary. We are not asking some you to are, go and pay two thousand Ghana cedis. Some, 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 some are higher than others. So what? In every prof professions, we have superiors. We have, we have um, subordinates. We have workers working and the workers. Your pay is not up to, but you still want to be in that profession. That profession, pay for it. Okay. If your pay is not up to two hundred, speak up. Mm. Whoever is paying you, tell them it's not up to 200 or it's not up to what you think you deserve. So I'm, I'm very certain that's the reason why they agreed on negotiating on the price. So do they, then go back so do they want to pay one CD for the license? I mean, how are you going to appreciate it? Then everybody can just wake up and go and buy a registration form and just pay the one CD, two CDs. And become a teacher. 200 cities for crying out loud. It's not even a huge amount. Of, well, I can't even say it's not a huge amount. Of, before somebody, somebody sits in their home right. and tell me, I win your home. Exactly. <laughs> you get it. Right. But if you are, you are into a profession, is, is, is it's, it's, it's yeah. money. Yes, it's, it's right. a huge money it for is. me. Yeah. Mm. You get it. But if you are in a profession that they are asking you to pay a certain amount, of, just go by the rule.
And just pay. agree to it. It's like, pay. Mm. Get your, be proud that you're a mm. teacher. Right. Teachers think that we should pamper them to a certain, you know, no, no, as I said, no, no profession, profession is, is easy. easy. Helen says something like, eh, you wake up and you have to go and teach somebody and maybe you're not in a good mood. The doctor wakes up and he has to go and see to somebody. He's not in a good mood. She mm. is not in a good mood. But somebody is bringing some sickness that they have to go and see to it. Mm. You get it? It's, it's a very difficult profession everywhere. That buyer, uh, that seller out there has to beg people to buy something from, from them. Mm. Sometimes they're not even in the mood to, uh, you know, pamper people, give them but some sort. Have to. But they have to because that is where you find yourself. So if you find yourself as a teacher, stop acting like we should, we should treat you like an, uh, a surgeon. <laughs> you are a teacher, you are a teacher, you are a doctor, you are a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> One minute. You know, this teacher issue can be so emotional and mm. we can go on and on and on and on about it. For me, I feel like they should, we should exercise patience and come to an agreement. Right. Understand them. Let there be a dialogue. Mm. In every situation or any uh, issue, if there is no dialogue, you don't get anywhere. Communication is very important. And it's, right. unfortunately, there's something that we, on this part of the world, we don't we even understand, understand it. Communication is is good for mm. everything. So they should dialogue with these people and mm. come to a conclusion, come to an understanding or that, some form of an agreement. Yes, you are supposed to be. That benefits both parties. Right. Yeah. If you have your one minute. As, as I say, their attitude mm. <laughs> as the same as the typical Ghanaian. Mm. <laughs> That everything. Refusing to even pay tax, mm. but wants to enjoy that road. Mm. They will be complaining about everything, but they are not paying their taxes. Mm. You are not paying your, uh, you don't want to pay to get your license, but they will be boasting, we are teachers. Let the demonstration come right now. They are in there. Mm. Mm. They want increment in salary, mm. but you are not a qualified teacher. Right. Architects do it. Nurses do it. Doctors do it. It's a profession. Just go get it done. Clear your mind of it, yes, so that you stand proud and say, you know what, I'm a teacher. So that we stop entertaining all these glorified maids, as I, as I said. <laughs> all these people, all these semi-literates right. who there haven't even gone through any you, formal you, you, you education. You're taking them through writing an exams mm. to be qualified teachers. Mm. After writing the exams, now they should now pay for a license again. Of course. That's a lot of stress. Of course. You have to pay to get it. Otherwise, stay home. You are still not a teacher yet. Mm. Don't come and teach anybody. Because it gets to a point in time when if you have an issue, right. you would have to, uh, you have to go to your superiors. Mm -hmm. You have to go to your administration. What, where do you stand? Are you a teacher a, a or somebody? Teacher. Exactly. So it, because teacher. when you go out there, you, c you can be an architect, but you can never ever, if you don't have the stamp that you've been, you, you have the license, mm -hmm. even in this country, if you've not written the exams, if you've not written architectural exams, you, you will are, not you be given a stamp right. to even be able to uh, design buildings and even for companies and for governments. Right. So you need it. These exactly. teachers should stop making noise. If it's even if it's ten thousand Ghana, it's your profession. Just we pay. are talking so much as if, if 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 even if when they get the license now, you force them to get the license. How would you know over millions of Ghanaians, everybody, all the teachers have licenses? Have licenses. Who is going to su supervise it? Right. Who is going to enforce it? Who is going to oh. supervise it? The moment they, they decided to do this license thing, the thought about exactly. All it's just like normal exams. It's just like that. normal exams. Right. If you right. you are not through it, you are not through it okay all right <laughs> it's getting heated up inside here <laughs> stay with us we will be right back are you expecting money from your relations abroad have you ever been defrauded of your money remittance? Open an ADB account today. Send your name and your account number to Relations Abroad. Ask them to use MoneyGram Direct to Account Service and receive your money in your account in minutes. With MoneyGram Direct to Account Service, there's no PIN code Wahala. You can now access your money on all ATMs in Ghana or send it to any mobile money wallet using ADB Mobile Banking App 
Oshot Code, star 7678. Visit our branches nationwide to conveniently receive your Western Union, MoneyGram, RIA, Unitylink, TransFast, and Express Money Transfers. Reach us on our Facebook, website, or call our hotline on 0302-210-210 for more information. ADB, truly a great and more. My name is Novi. The name is Phil. The man is the name. Laugh. And Lynn. What is the biggest animal in the world? King Kong. What is the main of the eye in iPhone? iTunes. What is Facebook? It's a book that you see it in your face. <laughs> what is the last book of the Bible? Methodist. Your father is a landlord. What will it be? Land Commission. House owner. Land Rover. <laughs> what do we do at the grocery shop? They play football. Who is Santa Claus? Teacher, we check you. Welcome back. This is still the good, the bad, and the ugly show. I have Helen and I have hey. Efia Jama in the studio. Hey, hey, hey. Now let's take a look at our very last um, newspaper, Daily Guide. Nana mocks Mahama for poor record. <laughs> <laughs> so here's what. We have a video for that. Uh, let's watch. Unprecedented, just an infrastructural development. I'm as I see so you who be a way about thousand on the average. JHS students, when he was in office, could not find a place in secondary school and had to go home because their parents could not afford it. Ghanaians prefer to go back to that and not free SHS. The people who were asleep when they were in the comfortable lead only to wake up to find that the country had rejected them. They are still asleep. They will not wake up and see that Ghana has moved on. We are moving on to a new era of hope and progress in our country. We have a leader who has no record he can defend, who has no prescriptions for the future, no policies for the future. We have never had any policy coming from this leader about what is going to happen in the future under him. Negativity, negativity, negativity. That's all we hear. Ghanaians have moved on. God is not so wicked as to punish Ghanaians again with the, the rule of John Mahama and the National Democratic Congress. That is not what God is going to do. Ghana has moved. <laughs> now here's what this is not the very first time Nana is doing this last year in June there was something like this again can we take a look at that here smoke out tama is it can you ever be a pregnancy me baha now baby yeah you know 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 you I have cry me kind and some me do a cry. Say, O pay ya nako o tigana bedrebu kesiemo. Ira Mahama or say ne breso. We have seen unprecedented infrastructural development. Mukai unprecedented just a infrastructural development abas i see so you who be a way about to want send that no kind of no let me say me mom there baby i'm a con yes i'm a me who know the beer i'm a con a con and yet if you don't know there's a minute my friend wants and my good be a man if you don't know eh we made that me take care of no matter it's in the Hey! Mother. Now, I'm the end of the day. You know, all kind of crap. And I'm not here. All kind of 
good ones or what? The president was sleeping, so he didn't see the good road. How long could he have been have slept? Exactly. Not to not to have experienced a good road. Now here's what. Please, um, all <laughs> comments, contributions, and can cordially come in. Um, the number is on on your screen right now, so you can send us anything at all you would want us <laughs> to read to you, Helen. Go on. <laughs> You know, it's funny. It's funny how the the former president and the current president get at each other. Mm -hmm. But then again, eventually the president had to respond to Mohammed's attack right. because exactly. failure to do so mm -hmm. only leaves one person on the platform mm. still talking. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So he he does. People will say, "Why did he respond? Exactly. Or why did he comment?" He does have to comment. Right. He he, he like, has to comment the man about is talking it. Too much. Because this is yeah, the first time yeah. the former president has been talking right. and also trying to mock him. Mm -hmm. I don't know, there's some teasing going on right. between them. Exactly. But you know, it's it's it, it takes attention off too sometimes. Mm -hmm. But sometimes I would say that the former president, he needs to take it easy right. because some of these things is, is a mockery back on him. Mm. You understand? Because look at this, for instance. Now you have, it, it's not a good thing to notice that the, 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 the Voltarians are showing open appreciation to the president to the for the president. policies he has pursued. Mm. <laughs> I mean, this used to be like the stronghold for, or let me say, the World Bank for the NDC. Right. But now they are openly showing the appreciation. Hilarious. Yes. And they are being Ghanaians mm. as well. Ghanaians first. Mm. Development is all we need in this country. Right. Regardless of whatever political par party. Mm. For me, I say, if you have good policies, I would follow you. Right. Because good policies is all we need for development or for this country to be in sta good standing. But are the policies implemented? Yes, he started. For this very Is president. Is there policies we are going to chop? Are we going to chop policies? You say, we love you, go chop. <laughs> well, <that's>, uh, <laughs> you know, it's a good thing to also notice that, that the president's response mm. to the issue mm. uh, was, was devoid of personal attack. Right. You notice that, right? Mm. Which is how politics... Or political discourse should run. Mm. He didn't personally attack him. Mm. He focused on development, right. infrastructure, mm. his work, mm. his office. Mm. He didn't go attacking him that, oh, former president, your head is big. Mm. Or oh, former <laughs> president, you're now wearing shoes. Or oh, former president, you're sleeping. You've got you're not gray yes, you got gray hair all of a sudden. Right. He focused on the issues mm. and the developmental progress mm. that we are on. Right. So it's a good <laughs> thing for okay. me. Okay. If he, you funny, not funny, to funny, funny. Agree with what Helen is saying. Hilarious. Okay. That look at how the Voltarians openly. <laughs> as you see this video, you are jubilating. Mm. It's in Kumase MPP World Bank. Didn't you see Mahama when he went there during his time? Mm. Didn't you see how they welcomed him? Didn't you see the crowd? Did he win? People will pretend. One. And two, people will follow you if their pockets are full. Mm. Lay down all your policies. Speak big grammar. Mock somebody. If the pocket is dry. It is dry. It is dry. So you can wait. You can tell them, oh, wait. We have things in the pipeline. We are trying to. We will get there. We will get there. Until you get there, then they've taken you out of that seat. Mm. But, but, but if yeah, you know, um, this isn't the first time um, the NPP, this now government, has gone to the voter region. Mm -hmm. It's not a second. But it, they, they couldn't actually tell us some of the things they have done now in the voter region. Because they've done nothing. It's, it seems <laughs> the NDCs, the NPPs, they're just toiling with our feelings. Be because they've done nothing. That's the truth. Why do... But, that's, that's, let's put that aside. Mm. Why do people think that Mr. Mahama should praise uh, the president of mm. We should. are competing. He should be Ghanaian first. And he should be Ghanaian first. Development. Mm. Where the MPP is not in. Why are we not always Ghanian? politicizing everything? You see, that is our problem in this country. Okay. Okay. Whatever the problem. president said, mm. was he not politicizing things? Mm. Hmm. He was. 
everybody is good when they are on the when they are off the seat. Right. They tend to rule the country better. So when they this are in the whole position. attitude of oh, so now Nana is mocking the president Mahama when people are crying. He's mocking when we him are crying in a good that direction. we don't have monies in our pocket, we are starving. Mm. The, 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 things are really hard, and you are talking about um, policies and things you want to implement and things you are putting in the in, in place. And in pipe, yeah, there the are pipeline. Every, pipeline has become the way <laughs> of, he's uh, of mocking MPP. him. You promised he, to change Ghana into, into 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 uh, uh, heaven mm. for us. Mm. When you were in opposition, mm. when you were campaigning, right. Ghana was going to be the best place on earth. And right. it will be. It will and be. now, it's it been three years. It will Next be. year is election year. Exactly. How, how, long, how long was exactly. the, other, the previous it, it, government it, it, in power? It, 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 what it, it, were they able to do? Hello, were darling. Was Ghana heaven? Hello, darling. Time not day. Mm. And it seemed the f the, the, all the focus was on the free SHS thing. Exactly. Yeah. So all Look, other... when you say you're hungry, you take time to cook, don't you? No. Before you eat, sometimes you if just you can't walk cook, out you go out there already. and then you go and buy. If yeah, she's using your time, and then if you go home, you minute. order your your <laughs> nanny or your house help to cook for you. It's still a process. It's still a process. You don't just Ghana, go and Ghana, then your nanny has all your. Okay. your Ghana your is not plantain right and cassava. Oh, okay. Okay. And that presidential seat is not the coal pot or the gas. Okay. Gas cooker. Mm. So we are not cooking anything and boiling anything for anything to be a process. Mm. Time not day. We need monies in our pockets. We need to be comfortable. And that is all we, we need think to enjoy about. our roads. Mm. We need to we, enjoy we our see, lights. We right. need to we enjoy we our want quick okay. money. That's why on so everything. You, you, you both have thirty seconds. Even on the on the data we use. Okay, so you're why? using your thirty seconds now. Taxes okay. everywhere. Right. No, I'm not using mine. Let's say use the face. <laughs> <laughs> Helen, you have the floor. <laughs> See, why are we so lazy in this country? Mm. Are we? We want everything. We see. We don't. We don't. You see, the thing about us is we forget and don't think about the future. Mm. We want now, 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 now. So three years for policy and then how many years for implementation if for I an another whatever years you give this government again okay. you will see the development that you need to see okay. you see it to completion right you understand we want everything that is why the youth now they don't want to take their time and go through the process mm. they all want quick money and mm. look at the number of youth that are dying because they go through the shortcuts mm. to, to try and make money and belong mm. Meanwhile, when you go through the process, it's a long-term celebration. It's a long-term enjoyment. It's a long-term fulfillment. Mm. But if you want to cut corners, it's a short-term thing for you. But, but, that is why we are where we are in Ghana now. Right, but, but if we will be patient mm. and understand the process and support, mm. regardless, irrespective of which political party you belong to, mm. Ghana first and support, Ghana should be well for all of us. Okay, so this is what we are paying that we more, want. It's more or less if Ghana access. is okay, it's for the benefit of me. Okay. I deserve it because I am a citizen of this nation. Okay. So I need this country to work. Okay, so it's more or less like we, the Ghanaians, we don't even understand Hello. what, what Mother we Ghana want. Is. Exactly. Right. You right. see, if yeah, when she was seconds. talking, she was all about her, why are we so lazy? Mm. Why do we want to use shortcuts? Mm. Are you ha are you more hard working than that farmer, that cocoa farmer in the village? Mm. Are you more hard working than that hawker on the streets? Do these politicians want to tell us that they work harder than those people? Mm. All these are professionals. Helen, you, you have your All no? these are professionals. You Helen, choose hard a farmer. You try a farmer. They, 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 if they, I choose to be, I choose no, you can't use my time. If I choose to be a doctor, Helen, I will be a doctor. Helen, be a doctor. So everybody you. has if their you, profession. If you are a teacher, you are a farmer, you are a lawyer. When you are a politician, they use my money to pay you. Right. So you are not hard working that than that person who is on the who street. Who is on the street? Hawking. Right. Selling pure water. Right. So you can't spend the monies of the people and, and make it look like you are so hard working so you deserve it. Mm. They overspent. Okay. So they should stop this attitude of we are, we are doing so much and we are putting things. They are just chopping money. Okay, okay. Money okay. that belongs to me. Exactly. And my people. Okay. So now to what I, I think about it. I think, you know, we Ghanaians, we vote out of anger and hunger. Mm -hmm. Of course. Yes. Mm -hmm. So you never know. Mm -hmm. Probably the sitting government. Is an angry man. Oh yes. 
and and and, and that is sad. that shouldn't be personally uh, i think if Ghanaians will come together make our minds right and say that we are taking npp ndc out of the equation and vote for happen. somebody let it's it's a mindset we just no, need to that is not we just need to come together you think that's you do that anyway they are coming they won't okay. come and chop money if yeah there are messages here so um from justice in upper west he says on behalf of my colleague teachers I wish to express my sincere disappointment on my sister who claimed teachers should pay the license fee. That is, if, yeah. Please, what is your profession? Who made you to become who you are today? I'm highly disappointed in your speech. And that you do not opinion. fit to sit and condemn teachers to pay fees. Please go back to your house and rethink the hassle teachers actually go through if Shoot you are truly a Ghanaian. Okay, there's another one here. Hmm. Um, that's a, I'm Prempe from Kumase. I agree with the fear. After free SHS, what has Nana Ado been able to implement into Helen? If you want us to wait, why then didn't we wait for Mahama at all? Now MPP and NDC the same mother. Hmm. Exactly. Okay. How I wish NPP will be in power for the next 30 years because I'm yet to give birth to my child. To also enjoy the good policies of NPP. Exactly. Victor Obri Yabwa um, exactly. says this from Obasa Sam Jona. Ha! Huh. <laughs> time for girl talk. Yeah. Time, time, time for girl talk. Favorite segment. Yes, favorite segment. So, yes, okay. kindly stay with us. We will be right back. Wild Lifestyle Show, you get to hear and learn about everything lifestyle that impacts on your general health and well being be it medical, social, economic, nutrition, lifestyle, name it. I believe in God, I don't believe in medicine. Oh, having said that, if you still want to go on keto diet, my strict advice is it should be done under clinical supervision and it should be something you do for only a brief period of time because the body was not meant to be on that for life. Nice. One more. Okay, <laughs> come on slowly. Well, I can feel this one. Yes. Indeed, the Wild Lifestyle Show is here to improve your life. Yes, your lifestyle, my lifestyle, our lifestyle. We definitely will be flying in good health. My name is Helena. I am the nutritionist and I'll be your pilot for this show. talk now today we are we are looking at show traditional roles for husband and wife be revisited traditional roles yes for husbands and wife yes should it be revisited um <laughs> you're thinking about it i'm thinking about it okay because, yeah. huh. <coughs> should it be revisited mm -hmm. no okay for whatever mm. 
backwards never. never. So you, you like <laughs> yeah. the men being the boss at home, so you should just remain like that. No, the traditional roles. Mm. Those yes. were the roles that men felt like they are men. Okay. And they, the women are supposed to be in the kitchen. Mm. And the men would just be doing, they don't help in so anything. So you shouldn't be okay. At all, at all, at So all. women should continue to be in the kitchen. I think it should be revisited. No. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it should be. Say. It should be. That's what I say. You say no, it shouldn't. No, it shouldn't. It oh, shouldn't so you be. want to be in the kitchen and cook? You, you want to be no, a housewife no. all the time? Uh -huh. No. Uh -huh. You don't want to have a say uh -huh. when it You're, comes no, to No, you're things? getting this wrong. Okay. Traditional roles mm -hmm. were the roles where the men where the ones going out there and the women were sitting at so home it's the same taking thing, care. Yeah. So should we go <laughs> back to it? And I'm saying no, we don't have to go back to women are working now, men are working now. Let's okay. just continue with our lives like okay. that. Okay. 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 You okay. get it. Right. Let's okay. just continue with the kind of lives. lives we are living now. Okay. We take the kids to the school, mm -hmm. then we go and live our lives. Okay. What's a big deal? <laughs> so if you say no, it shouldn't be revisited. Mm. Yes. So we should go on with our lives. We should live that our lives. That means that men should exist. Exactly. It should exist. Exactly. Because it's still there. But if I'm saying it should be revisited, it seems the fear is getting more confused about it. If I'm saying, yeah. If I'm saying it should be revisited, it means that in today's century or now. Women should not be traditionally uh, mm. uh, camped in the kitchen. Mm. Women are working. Women are bosses. Women are CEOs now. Mm. So that whole, even if you marry a woman and she's, she's, she's working and right. you are not, mm. you expect her to stop her work okay. and stay home with you because you are sitting home as a man? Mm. No. She has to go. Women are the bosses now. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. So that so whole traditional... It shouldn't, we shouldn't go back it to it. It should be revisited. That is what it means. It so should women be should stay home and... and it should, no, it should be revisited. So, yes. Yes. If you say no, then it shouldn't be. Yeah. We should abide by the rules and regulation then. If you need to so shut up. Uh, <laughs> no, you're getting it wrong. <laughs> you, you think so? Yeah, you uh, you are getting it wrong here, okay. darling. Anyways, okay, so, so my stand is uh, okay. Let's read it. Let's just okay, 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 read some. Yes, yeah, there are some comments here. Um, that's a hello. I'm Benny from Somania. I'm not in support for teachers paying lenses. Hey, it seems everybody's attacking the fear today. I'm dead. The government should <laughs> learn to motivate teachers a little. How much will it cost the government to pay for that? After all, they have been enjoying numerous allowances. And you know, this guy gives us an emoji like this. Mm. <laughs> He's serious about it. Oh, yeah. So, so serious. So, viewers, um, our phone lines have been um, activated now. So, you can call in and share your thoughts with us live like this. <laughs> Helen. I think it should be revisited okay. because, I mean, the whole traditional background mm. of um, the man is the head of the house. Mm -hmm. The woman should be... Okay. The woman should I, be... I, 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 Helen, I think we have okay. a call on the line. Hello, good mm -hmm. evening. Um, my name is Danny Tintin. I'd like to comment on the Okay, go ahead. Okay, um, first of all, um, I think I support if you are on okay. the thing. Okay. It's just, for me, I see that like just to get rid of these uh, unqualified teachers. Mm. Then because I saw a whole teacher who doesn't even know what the key is. Mm -hmm. you get it? Yes. Okay. So if they are paying licensing, it's better. It, as a matter of fact, it should even be a periodical. I mean, if it's five years, they should renew it and those kind of stuff. Yes. And then back to the girl talk. Okay. Um, I think if she is right, because if uh, she's saying it should not be revisited, meaning uh, like we should just continue with the way things are right now. Okay. And if we should revisit it, maybe ladies should go back to the kitchen and men should go to the show. Oh, that's oh okay. Yeah, that was what exactly what I was saying. Yes. Okay. All and, right. Um, I really love your program. I really enjoy it. Thank Aww. you. Very Thank you so much. Thank Where you. did you say you, you, you called from? Too. Hello? He's well, gone. Uh, he's gone. So, so he actually see, understood and okay. he corrected yeah. us. Thank okay. you. So it it because he's me, really paying attention I, I, to I, this. I, I, I'm <laughs> very certain as the weather. The weather is making. Because you know? really, I I I was confused. I didn't even know what to okay. say again because okay. I knew Sorry. what I was saying. Sorry. The traditional role mm. is actually the woman being in the kitchen mm. and the man out there doing their... But in this day and age, mm. we don't do that anymore. Okay. Women are out, men are out. Okay. Oh, so, so we shouldn't go back. Right. Yes, right. we shouldn't okay. go right. and revisit right. that. Right. I right. say we should stay 
the way we are now. Okay, so there's a, a message here for you, if yeah. I'm dead. Oh, if yeah, I'm mm. really disappointed in you tonight. <laughs> oh, oh, you have oh. been defending the night adult each and every time, and now you become a betrayal <laughs> from Paul Willy uh, Mampong. Forgive me. Yeah. And we have a call on the line. Hello, good evening. Hello. Hello. Good evening. Your name and where you're calling from, please. Can you speak a bit louder for me? Because yeah, I can barely hear you. Okay. The name again, sir. Hello. I think we missed him. Yes, we did. I feel you were saying something. I was like, the, 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 who, whoever commented yeah. was like, <laughs> yes. Now no. I'm not defending. There's another one that's good evening, please. I'm Isaac from Aflao. I like your program this evening so much. Keep it up. Thank you. Thank you. Lady say thank you. Come on. Yes, thank, thank you. you. Yes. Thank you. And then he goes and says, okay, now I am very, uh, okay, we have a caller again. Good evening. Your name and where you were calling from. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> you never know you're calling from my darling. Yeah, I am Cordelia. Okay. okay. Please, I, I totally disagree with Ekia. Okay, okay. Why? I find that teachers write a, a, a external exam from campus. Train teachers write a external exam from campus. So you can never compare teachers to nurses. On the other hand, they write internal exams. Okay. So you see, with all this examination, and then you telling us that you don't have any confidence in these teachers who have passed their exams mm. on campus, and then they still, they will still have to come out and write uh, external exams. I don't agree with sister here. Okay. All right. Thank you so much for doing the calling. Another caller. Good evening. Hello. Yeah, okay. Nice. So I was saying that he goes on to say that, okay, I'm very disappointed in the teachers for complaining about the fees they will pay for their own um, lenses. The nurses are doing the same. So why the noise? Exactly. We have you a caller oh. on the line. Good evening. Uh, my name is Abraham. I'm calling from work. Okay. Go on, Abraham. Yes, I'm, I'm a teacher. Okay. Um, if you are like your permission. Oh, okay. <laughs> wait, I'm not one there, please. <laughs> I'm coming to you. Okay. Uh, you think Ghanaians will like everything free? Mm -hmm. Yes, that's what politicians want. Okay. They said they want to give everybody free things. And they go ahead to give free education. Mm. Did they consider the teacher welfare friends? Mm -hmm. If so, mm. should the teacher be paid for his lessons, and then the, the people with their teaching should be, I mean, go for everything free, free, free. You see, we are in Ghana here. The teacher is not regarded as anybody. Don't gain the, the child, but the, the child can insult the teacher. Are you getting my point? Yes, we are with you. You see, it's about time we have to prioritize things very well. Mm. Don't do this, don't do that. Mm -hmm. But then, the person you are teaching, you are instructing, you said that the person has the right to do whatever in the classroom. Meanwhile, the, the person teaching the child cannot do anything to correct the child. Mm. I mean, it is in the Bible, the good book. Play the role and spoil the, the child. The child. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, another caller. Okay, good evening. Your name and where you're calling yes. from? I'm Julian. Okay. Why I'm are Julian you calling, calling from? from okay, go ahead, my darling. Yes, please. Um, the thing is that I, I disagree with you here. Okay. Because I want to be a teacher when I grow up. Okay. Oh. okay. <laughs> Oh, you have to pay your two hundred. Like, don't really feel like that when I get to that level. Ah, yeah. no, but you have to. Just start doing susu. Yeah. Because I am still by the standard you pay the two hundred. Yes, Please do your susu. Ah, oh, okay, okay, buddy. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. L let me do um, a few messages. Right. And I come to you. Still on the teacher thing. 
Hey, I'm praying prayer from Kumasi. I agree with you, yeah? After three years, it is what has Nana Ado been able to implement? And to Helen, if you want us to wait, well, okay, I think I have read yeah, this. Yeah, you've read it. Yes. Let me go. I, the messages are too much. Um, I there's a call. The messages are just too much. I, 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 we can't. I'm so sorry if I am not able to read your message. So let me just go straight to my what I was saying. We don't want that because those days women were just kept, they were just kept. Okay, 30 seconds. You have 30 seconds. They were just kept under in rooms, like they were just covered up. Okay, now women have the wings, they are flying. Women are becoming presidents, mm. and we still want to go back to the ancient mm. days, to the where days we whereby have kept... women have to um, tie some cloth around their right. waist all day and be cleaning, sweeping. When the men right. go out there and okay. do what they like, yeah. okay. women are building skyscrapers That's your out there. Helen. Okay, so on that second. note of the confusion, I think that <laughs> Effie and I have the same point. <laughs> right. Okay, so let me quickly take two messages for the girl talk and let me wrap up quickly. If the men will be burying the kids themselves, then thank God, let's review the whole thing. If that is not possible, then couples should mature and grow extra sense to manage their homes and expectations. Please, the messages are so, they are too much. Forgive me if I'm not being able to read all your messages. Time this time. is where time permits us to end today's show. My name is Nana Kunedu Ajiman. I did this with Helen Asante and Efia Chama. Join us same time on Friday. Have a good evening.